I'm really excited because I haven't put together this video yet. I just collected the clips and now it's time to piece it all together and I can have fond memories of my trip home. Hi, I'm Wonderful Ida, an educational video producer based in Vancouver, Canada. I teach you how to film yourself so you can film once to teach many. If you want to leverage your expertise to make money, then make sure to subscribe to my channel because I have new videos every Wednesday. First, I had to come up with a concept. Last time I went home, I brought my nephew a dinosaur and he loved it and he asked me to bring him another dinosaur. So I saw this one in the store and decided to turn this into a reel. So I haven't seen all the footage together yet. I just know the idea. The great thing was it was a puppet, so it was easy to move around and play around with. And I even sent him some of the videos with the dinosaur ahead of time. So he, first thing he did as soon as he saw me uh, when I got there was ask where the dinosaur is because he wanted to play with the dinosaur already because he was so excited about it. So to put this together into a reel, I need to start by putting all my clips together. So I'm gonna start looking, I'm gonna press the select button so I can start selecting and I'm gonna go through here and I'm gonna look for all the dinosaur clips. I know something's a video and not a photo if there's a timer at the bottom of it so you can see all these are photos of my adorable niece and then this one with the 24 that is a video. And for this I'm only gonna include all the video clips, I'm not gonna include any photos. Perfect, so I have all of them. You can see that's still a lot of videos and I'm gonna have to compress it and put it into a shorter story, but you can see I have 41 videos selected. So this is gonna take some time. So to put the, all those videos into a folder, I'm gonna press this bottom button, which is an X with an arrow. And I'm gonna go add to album and new album and I'm gonna name it Dino, save. There we go, so I have all my clips in one album. Okay, so now that I have them all into a folder, I can go over to Instagram Reels. So go to Instagram, add, and a new reel. So as I'm gonna be adding these in, I'm gonna start by picking a song so that I can match the clips to go with the song so that I can cut on the beat as I add more clips. So I'm gonna go into the music and I'm just gonna go through this and I can pick a song here or I can look at my saved and see if there's a song here that I wanna use. When you're picking your song, you wanna consider is your reel gonna have long clips or short clips? If you want a lot of short, fast clips, then you need to pick a fast song. And if you want more longer clips, then you need to pick a slower song. The hardest part, I think, is figuring out what song you wanna add. Yeah, let's do this one. So I'm gonna start by adding the clips. So I'm gonna go swipe up and I'm gonna switch the folder to my clips folder. So I'm gonna go to dino and then I can see all my dinosaur stuff here. So let's start from the beginning. So what I'm doing when I'm editing my clip is I wanna add it to the beat. So I'm waiting to listening to the song and I'm figuring out where the beat is so I can add the clip. Let's go a little longer. This is looking so cute. You can add multiple clips from the same video, which is nice because you can show time changing and you can show the whole story. So you can see if I preview this one.
I'm gonna cut this one actually a little bit sooner. I'm actually gonna delete this one because when the clip is longer, it's harder to fine tune it because there's such a long clip. So it's easier just to add it again. So I'm gonna go back, swipe up. Where's that open the door? Okay, there we go. So we got out of the store and let's just keep going. So what you're trying to achieve by this is telling the story. You don't need to use every single one of your clips. You just want to use the ones that tell the story and help progress the story in the simplest way possible. So you can see I opened the door, I'm getting on the plane. Oh, that's so cute. So it's, see, it's acting up a little bit. So before I continue, I'm going to press that save button. It's going to save that video for me. So in case I lose this, it's there. Hit swipe up. There, that's actually really cute. Before you publish your thing, just go through it. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, so now I can go next. I can edit my cover and this is a new feature. So let's go down out of here first because it's acting up weird. Let's save the entire thing. So that way I have the video clip saved as is. There we go, it's saved. So in case anything crashes, in case I lose it, I have it available. And then I can go to next. I can edit my cover. So I can edit which cover I wanna use for it. So I like that. And then in here I can change how it's gonna look on my profile. So I can adjust it so it looks good on my profile feed. There we go, done. And now I can write my captions, tag my people, and post my reel. I hope that you enjoyed this video and that it helps you create your own traveling adventure reel. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or better yet, leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear any video ideas that you have for me. Until next time, peace.